Welcome to Graft Tutorials, I'm Shiva and in this video we're going to take a look at Generative Color in Adobe Illustrator which is an AI powered option to discover new color schemes using prompts. So as you can see I already have several vector images uh, ready, I copy pasted them so we can have our original and try out some of the Generative Color options. Um, generative Color only works with vector images so be sure you have a vector image if you want a png transformed into a vector image i have a separate video on that one which i will link in the description and i will place a card in the video um, but for now i have a vector which is grouped so i can click once and i select everything if it's not grouped you can group it or you can just slide your mouse and select everything like that the generative color can be accessed using the edit window option and then go to edit colors and choose generative recolor or you select your image you go in the properties and there you click recolor which gives you the recolor option which you can check in that other video or you can choose generative recolor and here you have the option to use a prompt and you have some sample prompts with which illustrator provides you so let's start with a sample prompt i'm going to try the dark blue midnight and when you click the sample prompt illustrator will start to generate and give you color schemes which it thinks are dark blue midnight and then you can click that and then your image or your vector transforms you can also press generate again and then it will regenerate the prompt you just gave it in case you weren't happy with the options it provided you and then you get other sorts of schemes but now let's try this one recolor um, maybe one more sample prompt the lavender storm sounds interesting and it is quite interesting okay now let's try to make a prompt ourselves um what are we going to say summer let's try just summer and see what it does yeah it's kind of summery i think I'm going to go through edit, edit colors and generative color, recolor. Um, cyberpunk neon lights. That's kind of cyberpunky, I guess. And then the last one, say we're going to do emerald, which is a sort of green, which fits the forest. Mm, try again. As you can see, it also keeps the first ones it gave you. So it just adds on top of that. And let's pick this one. But yeah, we can keep going on like this. We can try all sorts of prompts. Uh, AI prompting is something is something unique on itself. Um, so be sure to check out how to prompt to get what you are searching for. Generative recolor in Adobe Illustrator, AI powered. Um, saves you the time from going through all the colors uh, in illustrator and searching what you're looking for you can just prompt it and hopefully illustrator will provide you with what you're looking for so that was it for this video a quick tutorial on how to use the generative recolor in adobe illustrator be sure to let me know in the comments if you like this video press the thumbs up button if you did if you want to see my future work maybe also press the subscribe button but for now stay creative and i hope to see you in the next one
Thank you.